I'd like for the for the first match, Yanuman, tell us a little bit about your observations of how things went down. Yeah, I think it was a competitive game. We came close at the end. Um, half time, I think we were kind of happy to have that as a chasing score. Um, just couldn't get there at the end. Um, but hopefully, next time we can we can get there. Your own performance was pretty good. Are you satisfied with the way that you started out? Yeah, I think um, didn't skid on as expected against the spinners. Um, so it was quite a challenge to, to face from the start and then just had to try and capitalize against the seam um, while they were still figuring out what to do. I think they adapted well in the middle to just um, change their game plan a bit to make it a bit more difficult for us, but just try to back my strengths against the seam. Are you happy with the way that you faced the spinners? Um, I think the, the, there's room for improvement, maybe committing order, um, having clear plans. Um, just sit and think about it and then come back with, with, with better plans. Yeah. And how were the conditions? Um, just obs observing from the sidelines, because you don't experience it too much, but having a look at the fog and um, how you assess the wicket after that. It's quite interesting weather, um, new conditions, the fog came in, it came in late, so credit to them for taking two important catches and, uh, getting two good batters of ours out. Um, and yeah, it's obviously wet outfield, do balls wet, but the wicket didn't skid on as much. Um, so we'll just take the lessons learned into the next couple of matches. Some of the areas of improvement that you'd like to see from your own team? Um, I just think in terms of going through what, what happened tonight and maybe having better plans or seeing what worked, what didn't work, and then just going and executing that. So I don't think it's a, a uh, matter of execution, just kind of ha having the right plans because some, some stuff are easier and more difficult to hit so we should just um, come back with good game plan. Mm. Do you, a lot is being said obviously about the struggles of the batting unit. Um, how, how do you think they're gonna, what needs to happen for the batting unit to be able to, to get themselves into better positions, particularly when it's um, really big moments closer to the end of the match. Yeah, I think what you want as a batting unit is you want to win games for the team. And <clears throat> we obviously weren't far off, so we're not that far from clicking. I think maybe we had a couple of partnerships, but maybe one big partnership. And then guys just coming in, backing their strengths, playing their game, um, trusting what got them in, what got them this opportunity. and just communicating what the best options are for each player. And I think we, we're not far from it. Reza Hendricks had a really good innings um, after starting off really slowly because he'd faced about seven balls in, in the entire time you were there. Um, how, how did you observe him and um, how happy are you for, for his performance? Yeah, I must say um, Reza was in quite a difficult position when I got out because he didn't face a lot of balls without the power play. So the way he came back, kept a cool head, um, kind of got got the strike rate up again. Um, credit to credit to him, and happy he got a good innings. I think he's yeah. Obviously, when you're in, you're upset. You couldn't finish the game, but he obviously was unlucky with his dismissal. Um, so yeah, he, he had a very good innings. And what's it like to be one of the most capped players in in the team currently? Because you're in a team full of quite a few youngsters. Yeah, that thought actually came through my mind thinking about the uh, caps in the team. Um, <clears throat> but it's obviously a good opportunity just to kind of to 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 add value where you are. Um, but everyone, we're just working together as a team. Doesn't obviously experience is important, but if everyone can just focus on their job and what they can do, um, it's not that important. It's obvious we're missing it, but. Um, I think every player can captain their own space and bring value and that's kind of the nice thing and exciting thing about having a young team as well, opportunity for the leader, for your leadership skills to come out as well. And speaking of leadership skills, how's Heinrich Klaassen as a captain? Yeah, um, he's very good, he has a calm head, um, talks to the point, has clear plans, um, so I think he, he's a good captain. <laughs> And finally, being 1-0 down, does that give a lot of added pressure to the team um, coming into a second game out of the three-match series? Yeah, I think when you play at this level in, um, against Pakistan, 
there'll always be pressure, but I think it's just also a good opportunity to to kind of bounce back hard and kind of show that ability. And then one game momentum can change into the final final game. So it's a good opportunity to kind of show fight and come back strong.